Gumfrey is a plant that we have used in Texas gardens as a pass along plant for many, many years. Um, its uh, heat tolerance is, is well known amongst gardeners, but in recent years we've had a lot of new varieties of Gumfrina come out, which has been one of the reasons that we want to promote it as a Texas superstar this year, um, because there's a lot of things out there um, that gardeners can now choose from. This is the traditional color of Gomfrina, and uh, we've got now varieties that are the everywhere from the short uh, types up to these taller types um, that can do perform different functions in the garden. We've also got some newer colors of a more of an intermediate size um, with the traditional colors plus things like pink. Um, and we've also got uh, an expansion of the number of selections of white um, varieties that we can use now. Up here we have the uh, all around purple variety and you can see how much it, taller it is. Um, it's got a good stature in the garden and can be used as a background um, so that you can uh, mix it with other heights of, of plants. This is the white ones in the Las Vegas series, which is more of an intermediate height um, that does very well um, and is kind of a, a medium height that you can use in mid-border when you're mixing it with other annuals and perennials. This is the variety called Fireworks, and uh, it, it basically shoots these inflorescences up into the, up into the air, um, but then also you can see the little flowers or florets that are coming out of the bracts here that look like little sparklers. It's a tall plant, it can be used as a specimen or as a grouping. It's also, uh, this kind of shows up the drought tolerance of Gomfrina as well. These plants, I've seen them growing out in very dry conditions. Uh, they, in fact, they stand up better and don't fall over and that sort of thing. If you, the more sun and, and heat and drought that they get. They do need some watering, you know, to keep them going during the summer, but they'll, they'll take a lot of abuse.